hey, Captain Dave Schneider, it's a guide's life. Here we are, day two. Day two. Day two. Dos equis. I don't even know if that's what that means, dos equis. That means a beer. Dos equis. Two equis. Two beers? I don't know if dos, no, dos is, two. is beer. Equis is a, is a brand of beer. Okay. Two. Two days. Two dias. Two dias. Dos dias. Dos dias. Paracut took a lot of Spanish. He's he's pretty well fluent. Um, Learned it last night at the uh, tiki bar there yep. in uh, Cluiston. Yeah, yeah. We're, immer immersion has always been the oh. best uh, sort of thing. And you know, if you go to the tiki bar, they speak almost no English. So if you want to get a dias, no, that's day. If you want to get a cerveza, cerveza, you better speak española. I'm just making that. <laughs> anyway, anyway, guys, listen, we're up. We're up in the Harney Pond area, guys. We're gonna. Yesterday, listen. I'm yesterday. We did not catch a lot of fish, but I want to say a couple things about that. Always, you know, every good guide has his excuses, and so it's time for me to kind of put mine out there. First of all, we specifically were fishing for a big bite, and we did. I mean, we threw baits, and we threw baits at a pace too, and I and we had a couple of nice bites. We just we just didn't we just didn't get it done, uh, you know, ultimately. But having said that. It wasn't a fast and furious deal, um, so we we left we left the. Uh, I just want to emphasize, there's still a lot of fish down in South Bay area. Um, it, it's that that pattern. You got to put your poles down, pitch in the holes, whether it's a fluke, a senko, um, whatever. Uh, you know, whatever kind of whatever kind of soft plastic you like to throw, a uh, small swimming worm. Uh, you're you're going to still catch them there. Uh, but we we are looking for a big fish. So we've come up to Harney Pond. The water was 72 yesterday when we got off the lake. It, which is man this should be going on right now so we're coming up to Harney Pond here Joey Berg and and, uh, and Rob Lunkers TV they they, uh, they caught him pretty good up in this area yesterday he caught some big ones and uh, and so we're up here uh, we're not going pony in on their on their numbers but 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 I've got a bunch of stuff up here so we're gonna we're gonna run around here and see what we can make happen but like I said we're gonna keep just a few rods on the deck we're gonna move probably a lot faster. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna slow down and fish when we get to the spots, but we're not gonna spend a lot of time fishing areas. We're gonna just keep moving and and find those aggressive fish. Captain Dave Schneider, you stay with us. We'll be back. All right, wait. We've moved into the back end of of uh, behind the hard line in 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 the Harney Pond area by Dice Ditch. The water is gorgeous. Now I've I've been looking at this water for for a month and a half, but the weather or the water temperature has just never been right. It's right. We're gonna we're gonna spend probably an hour or two back in these areas here. We're gonna we're gonna kind of move fast. We're just looking for some fish activity, and then we'll slow down and fish it a little bit more to the liking of the bass. But we're gonna cover some water here. Uh, but but I I, I really I, I'm excited right now. So let's let's see how this thing rolls. right there and he just uh, well you saw it <laughs> we I don't, no commentary needed on that one and that's you know what we're in we're in the middle of the dollar dollar pad area this is a this is a good fish guys this is a good fish nice one It's a spawner, bro. Look at that. That fish is spawning like crazy. Wow. Look at that fish. Number one is a pretty good one, man. That's a nice white spawner, bro. No? Yep. Here we That's go. A good one, bro. That's a good one. That's what we're after.
Good morning, everybody. Captain Dave Schneider, it's a guide's life, and the saga continues. Today, we are not going on Lake Okeechobee. Nope, 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 nope. Today, it is, it is 4.04 a.m. This is like some kind of new record for Captain Dave, by the way. Getting up this early and going fishing. But, 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 but. Okay. Anyway, listen, listen. We're going over to Lake Keenansville. Yep. Now, apparently, it's serendipitous that I actually... Yeah, that's right. It's 4 a.m. and I just said serendipitous. <laughs> but apparently, um, Rob has like fished this lake a couple of times with, with, uh, with Scott Martin and, and, uh, and, and whatnot, apparently. And so he's like, like yesterday, they're like, Okeechobee is so tough. Man, these guys just want to go, you know, they want to fish someplace else, and which is totally cool. I, it's kind of a new thing for me because I've never actually guided in Florida on any lake except Lake Okeechobee. So, um, so this is, this is going to be new ground. Uh, the fact that I just drove every inch of this lake and mapped it is, is just hilarious in my mind. Um, I've, I've, I've I got my maps. In fact, I, I just got done putting them on an SD card. I went to my site. Um, I created the map, downloaded the map, and put it on my SD card, along with actually some updates. My my carbon units had an update, so I got those and popped them in my in my in my uh, uh, graphs. And so I'm ready to go. I've got the map of the lake, including that's right the bottom hardness. I'm actually going to show you uh, a little bit of that uh, on the lake. I'm going to show you what the bottom hardness map looks like. It's so key because now I know where the hydrilla is and I also know where the hardest bottom is. Let's see if that makes a difference. Let's see if that translates into some fish. But anyway, it's early, early, early and I have got, I have got 20, no, yeah, I've got 24 minutes to get dressed and get in my truck and go get over and pick them up. So anyway, me and Perrick and Samwise, Samwise, by the way, is Perrick's, uh, camera guy and editor he's a great dude man um anyway we're, we're heading down we're gonna follow uh or um we're gonna follow rob and and uh and joey burke anyway cap dave schneider stick around man do you like the hair do you, do you like do you like the hair this is this is my holy crap i just got out of bed look <laughs> see you in a little while I'm sorry if that occurred. I just threw a little bit of a finger. I'm gonna do it. Wanna switch sides with me? Oh! Ah, we got that! I got that one! And I guess he wanted it fast because I was all of a sudden brought it to the top and was kind of ripping it and he got after it. That's a good fish. That's not a bad fish at all, boys. That's I, I, probably fifth or sixth bite on this swimming worm. It's the first time, it's the first bite, or it's the first uh, fish I've hooked, but I've also changed my rig and got the right hook and the right weight on it and stuff like that. Hey guys, are we, are we just putting these in the well and weighing our best five? Is that what the plan was? Because that's what he said. I don't know. I'll put, we'll put them in here for right now. We can always, we can always it's a nice boat ride for him. We can always, uh, we can always let him go after. Nice fish, uh, two and two and three quarters. Real heavy, big belly. Well, uh, we've had it. We had we had six bites in here. Do we do we have service we call? Well, that is how you do it, boys and girls. He just sent 
a two pounder all the way over to the side of the deck. And there ain't no fish over here, but this one's going in the live well if you don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. That was fantastic, bro. I thought it was like Damn. a six pounder. I I, it, it, jacked them. They look so big when you do that, man. Good job, bro. Yeah, bam, bam. Thank you. Come on, still be there. Still be there. Oh, he's here. He's not that big, but he's a good one. Oh, he's a good one. Good one. These are nice fish. Whew. Okay. We're gonna keep at it. Who's with me, huh? Man, that's that's three and three quarters. You know that? That's a really, really nice fish. Get him up, get him up. Turn that reel handle. Turn the reel handle, Bob. Keep him coming. Just turn, 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 turn. Stop. Don't stop turning the handle. Don't stop turning the handle. Rot up, 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 rot up, 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 up. Don't reel anymore. Don't reel anymore. That's a good one, bro. That's a good one. That's a good one. Buddy, that's a really, really, seriously, that's a nice one. Look at that little bait you got. Look how fat that is. Put him right, put him right underneath your feet, man. Good one. That's a pretty fish. Nice. That to the hydrilla and that. On the, oh, oh, man, something just piled. Did you see how hard he hit? There he is. There he is. Come here, baby. This is a good one. Well, he's not as big as anywhere near as big as I thought. But man, did he hit that bait? Did he hit this thing? This fish is nowhere near as big as I thought it was going to be. My gosh, Almighty! He just pounded this thing, man. This is a little one. It's a little one. But man, I mean, did you see my line pop? Just a peanut in relative in relativity. I don't even know if I don't think this is probably smaller than anything we have in the live well. I'd say for sure it is, wouldn't you? So, man, I, I, I really, when it hit, boom, I, and I set the hook on it, I really thought it was going to be a really big one. Good one, bro. Boom. Nice. You know, yeah, right there, Perry. There, there are absolutely going to be a fish or two on the back inside of this. Yeah, that makes five, but it's nothing. To, this is nothing that we want to take to the weigh-in. <laughs> But they're here. Back. Oh yeah, absolutely. Little peeing male. This guy's peeing. So you see the next spot, right? Right out here. Between here and there, man. Oh, there he is. Come on. Oh yeah, this is pretty good one here. Okay, come on, dude. Come on. Come here, baby. Come here. Oh, you're not that big. He's a good one, though. Come here, baby. Come here. Come here. Come here. What do we have in here, fellas? What do we have in here? Look at that fish. Yeah, we'll, we'll take this one. Oh, my gosh. Come here, baby. <laughs> yeah. I'll take a bag of these, well. Take a bag of these. It's it's just spot on, man. Spot on. 
Give me the knuckles, man. Nice. Bam. Nice, dude. Nice. Thanks. There we go. There we go. Good trade. There he is. Come right up on top. Got it? Yep. Out a boy. Out a boy. It's all right. First bass of the day is probably about very, very much worth the trip to go get him. All right, let me pull one out of that other side there. Okay. Oh, chunky, yeah, I agree. Yeah, I think I'll get him. Nice. That's a pretty one. Oh. All right, we're going to rewire. Oh, this fish is how big, did you say? 8.3. You got her? I think so. Yep. Let's get our board here. Oh. oh, my gosh. What is it? Eight four and three quarters. Okay. Eight five. Eight five. Eight five. Eight five. We'll call eight five and a half actually. Okay. Eight five and a half. Count it. Wow. Oh, you got one of the really fancy ones. I've got a good oh, scale. You got really, really fancy yeah, ones. I got the eight five and a half. That's my God. I would. I would have thought honestly. Look at the belly. I, it looks like a nine and a half or a ten. It really does. Show them. Show them what you're That's just spectacular, man. That's just absolutely spectacular. Well, let wow. Go. Wow. Good, what a fish, man. Good what a fish. Go. Congratulations, bro. That's just beautiful. You want to put her back? No, go ahead. You right. got it. Here we go, sweetie. Thanks for playing. Wow, what a fish. Thanks for letting me hold it. I, honest to God, you don't, as often as we do this. You got the first trophy catch in my boat. It, it, oh, that's right, brother. New boat, first trophy catch. Well, hey, everybody. Captain Dave Schneider. It's a guide's life, and we are calling it a fishing day. A day. A day indeed. Listen, uh, actually, you know what? It, the fish was, it was a grind. Uh, it, it uh, we actually were rewarded. We kind of had a really nice pattern handed to us. Uh, Joey and Rob uh, had kind of stumbled across a, a swim bait deal, slow rolling a swim bait, and it turned, to be, it turned out to be gold. It, it really was. It was such a specific bite though. It was really, really specific. And you, you had to, you bet you basically just crawled it one of the keys to the deal was it was a we were using a belly weighted uh swim bait uh, hook a lot of times i don't use belly weights i'll put a little weight on the front nose because i want it to kind of fall down into a hole and that kind of thing but this one was just predicated on getting it down into the grass and it was really it was amazing actually how well uh how well it, it came through the grass i mean just you just kind of work it real slow and, and the fish it just boom and it was uh it once we got that figured out it it turned out to be fun you know it turned out to be fun uh listen Peric man I, thank you so much yeah thank you for having me seriously oh you bet man I, I it's a blast and, and you guys you guys samwise listen okay, man thank you absolutely so much for a, absolutely a, a pleasure to meet you bro um and tomorrow i'm back to work so to speak <laughs> <laughs> if you call it work yeah anyway i'm sorry i, I don't mean to be like that uh but tomorrow I, I've, I've got guests coming in and, and i i don't i think it's probably going to be a shiner trip uh, it might be a combo thing right now the lake is it's guys i'm not gonna lie to you south florida right now is fishing pretty tough uh you know even though the water temperatures are up and whatnot it's it's fishing tough so captain dave schneider it's a guy's life i'm going to see my grandson right now <laughs> so anyway i'm gonna go do that maybe i'll uh, uh I'll, I'll get this i'll get this video up to you guys pretty quick here but captain dave man i love you guys thanks for watching it's a guide's life is a great life oh hey, hey, hey if you like the video for god's sakes hit the like button but don't smash it more than once because then it unlikes i just recently found that out actually <laughs> uh, and the other thing too is guys listen 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 if you are not a subscriber oh and by the way man welcome welcome to the subscribers that have come over that that, that have been following Perry for so long guys i'm up around i'm probably over 3,000 now 
Uh, this this little venture here is is pushed me up three four hundred subscribers in just the last twenty four hours. It's so cool, man. Uh, and, and listen, I, I dig it. I dig it, man. Welcome aboard. Thanks for subscribing. I, I hope to keep your attention and, and, and make it worth your while. Um, for those of you who have been around for a while, for God's sakes, man, I know you got friends. Share the video. All right, Captain Dave Schneider. I'll see you guys tomorrow.